Hello everyone and welcome to my first let's play of an adventure map and maybe you already know this map here this is the escape 101 map made by uh, Panda, Pommes and Booby and actually I once played the first room already but I don't know uh, if anything has changed because this was in an early alpha stage of the map and so far I only know that it is incredibly hard and I will totally fail all the time so it will probably more be like a let's fail and yeah that it often requires to punch through stone with your bare fist and we already hear a blaze so it, I'm pretty excited how this is going to be to work out um, I just wanted to start it because I just uh, never wa uh, always wanted to know how uh, the map looks like the others did so let's just begin here and see what we can get from the chest here maybe we can use this afterwards I have no clue because as far as I know there are also a lot of random items in the, in the chests uh, which you don't actually need that's what I know so far so first of all we see this uh, uh, stone wooden double half slabs but this sounds like wood so probably uh, that's what I know from the last let's play that some of the blocks here are actually uh, wood blocks and I have to get them as I said I once played the first room so that's what I know so far and unfortunately I can't get to this damn block here and everything on the map here is allowed so besides cheating of course so I will definitely grab the dot block here as well and um, can you punch one of these with your hand? Hmm. Not sure. Uh, and the furnace is already burning. I ah first music disc. Ah, uh, one goal is also to get all the music discs. So, hmm. um, well, I will just try if I can get this. Uh... No. Okay. Um. Well, I think I will just restart the map here, simply because uh, I guess I will need this. So you see I already made several backups of the world and I decided to play on the normal default texture pack again, because many people don't like Mesos textures. So um, we already know that there is one wood block over here and also the cracked stone bricks indicate that there might be, uh, there might be a way through them. Um, behind that and yeah we'll just check all the other blocks here if there are any further um, wood blocks oh okay oh shit <laughs> okay this is pr uh, probably um, well is there any way to get through this room uh, maybe a bit on end of all we'll see we got uh, the broken music disc gray Actually, there's also an additional goal of collecting all the music discs and, well, I am in a mushroom biome, so I can get this torch as well. So let's just grab everything which is in here. We don't know if we need it or not. Um, yeah, it's pretty funny that the furnace is already lit. I think I'll just first look what's behind here. Oh, I'm already on bright, so I hope you don't mind if it's a little bit darker here. Oh, a cow. Hooray, I was right. And lava. Hm. Okay, so... I guess I will just take a look at what's behind this wall here because there are more cracked, of cracked stone bricks and I hear the cow behind the wall. Oh, it's a mushroom cow. I guess, I guess it's Randolph for the ones who know what Randolph is. <laughs> okay. Let's check the cra more cracked stone bricks. I guess I will speed it up when I'm just punching a stone uh, from now on because it will probably take too long. Okay, so that means pretty much everything is probably covered in bedrock here. 
<laughs> I could just punch through the complete wall here, or I uh, sacrifice one of my blocks here. Question is, will I ever need them? Um, well, we don't know. So we'll just find it out. Hooray! And I got a bowl, so I have finally something to eat. So, uh, I actually... I'm not sure, but... I guess I can't break a cordon with my fist. Um, the question is, what am I supposed to do now? <laughs> uh, let me think for a bit, or maybe I can find it instantly, because currently I have nothing to go, no, and not a single ender or anything. Um, and there are most cracked stone bricks, is there anything behind them? So, yeah, as I said, the, the, the map is probably like think what could you do maybe you can also if i uh, have no clue how to go on you can of course write some uh, comments down and i don't know when i may will make cuts in here to for our next uh, episode of it uh yeah but let's just uh, go on um hmm. so i could try to bridge uh, through the wall here to get the cow on the other side but would that help at all at least there's water below the cauldron. Uh, hmm. Well, it's probably not too easy. Yet. First I have to watch out not to die here. I will just make the entrance a little bit easier to access. Okay. Fuck. I can hear lots of empty dispensers going on and off. Um, hmm. So the question is, uh, can I get a minecart from anywhere here? Um, unfortunately I'm not sure if I'm able to break a call in survival, let me just quickly test So this. I found out it's not possible, but I could just remove the two blocks there to cover the lava in obsidian. And maybe get the cow to the other side quicker. Um, I guess that's what I am going to do now. Oh, there is. Uh, seems like there's a walkway or a tunnel below this. Okay, uh, hopefully, there's nothing below the lava or something. Ah, it's annoying that you have to punch so many stones here. Um, oh, not bad. So at least there's something here. I'm just curious what I should do with the cow. At least I get something to eat here. Um, yeah, I will first head to the light. Oh, punching iron bars with your fist will take ages. I will speed this up. Okay, there we go. So, what's here? Just a drop. <coughs> oh, of course I have... Oh, wait. There's something above there. Um... I'm pretty sure we'll never get a pickaxe here. Um, also, three wood is not enough to craft me one. No, of course not, because I need a... God, what's in there? Golden apple, hooray! Okay, <laughs> the question is uh, where to go. Um, I can't pick up any of these blocks here, so, yeah, I guess I will first go up again and check the other tunnel, and also what's up, up there, maybe I can get there without 
losing any blocks, I mean I can of course harvest them again, so let's just use the dirt and the wood here. <laughs> Another torch, maybe that helps. Don't know. Okay, was just a quick test if there's anything here, but it's empty. Okay, let's get our stuff back. Okay, let's check where the water flows. Maybe there's something more interesting around here. Okay, dispenser with... Oh! Already shaped like a minecart, of course. We are not sure if we can, uh, if we are supposed to make one. Because I could always also use the water. Well, where is this leading to? Is there anything above here? Hmm. Doesn't look like. Um, because it could be that I also need it for shears or anything else. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I guess I will have to try it out. I actually don't like this jump. And the vines already grew again. Okay, so I can actually reach the rail there, so it is possible. Optifine zoom, hooray. Uh, to place a minecart there. Well, I will test it out. But first I need a crafting bench. So let's see. There must be a forced um, wood block somewhere here. Ah, okay. Not bad. Hooray, we can craft us a table. Or, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the only thing I can do with the wood here. So let's just try it out. Okay, um, well, not bad. Yeah, my guess with the Ender Pearl was right, but uh, of course, there might be more hidden stuff here. I'm not sure if I can get the minecart back. For some reason, I can't hit it. And I can't access this because it's all bedrock. Um,. Yeah, let's just go through it. And of course I will take the crafting bench with me. I wonder if there's any purpose for the enchantment table here. I can't take it with me. I have a feeling that there's something hidden behind the furnace. The next question is, where are all the blazes? Oh god. Can't see any blaze in the room here. So well, let's just get through. Okay. Oh my god, this, this sounds scary. Hey, escape 101 by the survivor. I'm trapped. They found me sneaking around in the library. The hallway collapsed somehow. That gave me a few minutes. But now I can't go back to the pens. I'll leave the book in case someone else gets down here. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so... Question is... What to do next? 
Hooray! Iron ore. And another iron ore. Maybe there's a third one in here. Um, yeah, and I would like to have a night vision potion. Oh! Empty glass bottle. I will just, as I said, you get a lot of random stuff here. And you never know if you actually need it or not. Is there anything else in here? Okay, actually there's at least a way up there. Uh, well, I will first... I got an idea. Come on. Uh, we got two iron ores. Okay, the question is what to use to... Um, can you actually use a, a jukebox here? I guess a jukebox that has at least some use. I could activate a butt switch with it, but I could do this with any other lock, so let's just put it in there. Hopefully it's last enough, long enough. For two iron ingots. And I hear silverfish. Oh no. Uh, shit, 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 this won't last. I don't know if this was a good idea or not, but at least I got two iron ores now. Uh, two iron ingots now. And... Hmm. Might be, uh, might be that these vines are somehow useful. I'll get some. And a blaze just died. scared about the blazes. I hope they won't be that hard to get rid of. Let's just grab a stack of uh, vines here and let's see what else I can do with them. There's nothing more hidden here. I'll just destroy the dispenser and look beyond below. But if not, then come on. Oh, this also takes ages. Okay, nothing. I will just go down to the lights. Go up to the lights. Oh, fuck! 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 That's not good. Shit. I guess I had the spawner active the whole time. And... So the question is... Is there any way to get past these places without dying? I doubt it. Holy shit. Holy shit. Mm. I guess I will just make a backup of the, my current state here and try it out. Be right back.